and welcome to another exciting episode of Kentucky Brew Reviews. I'm Steel Reserve. Special K, and tonight we have Core Seltzers. Just came out, pretty fresh. Uh, seltzers with a mission. Steel, what's the mission? It is to restoring our rivers. They, One uh, pack, it's 500 gallons. Uh, how much were these? 13, 14 bucks? Something like that, yes. 4.5% uh, alcohol by volume. Um, and 90 calories, um, pretty common for seltzers. Yep. Most of them are 5% at 100 calories. They're just taking a little bit of percentage. Going big, huh? Starting off with wine. So, uh, core seltzers. Uh, okay. Labatt just came out with theirs. We're trying to find them. Haven't been able to do that yet. Uh, we're going to start out, like I said, still with the lime here. But, uh, core seltzers, storing our rivers, they've partnered with change the course to help protect American rivers that provide clean water to wildlife and millions of people. So you know what, um, I can actually get behind that, what they're doing there. So the flavors come in grapefruit, black cherry, uh, lemon lime, and, and mango. mango. So we're doing the lemon lime first. Uh, color, it's clear, it's seltzer. And it kind of smells like uh, the one earlier. It does in fact smell like baby pee. Uh, if you have a child, and you change a pee diaper, you know what I'm talking about. I do not. So, uh, it has that exact smell. Uh, very carbonated. Cold enough, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Not bad. Much sweeter than most seltzers, though. Yeah. Uh, sweeter without the... Bad artificial sweetener. What well, has get. two grams of sugar versus most of them have one. That's true. So why's keeping two cal? Why keeping ninety calories? Pretty good. All right, that's a good lime seltzer. It is. I like it better than white claw lime. I think yeah, it's still a lime. Probably be better, better a bit colder. Yeah. You know, but I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go six. Six on that one. Give it a 5.5. What do you think next? Grapefruit? Grapefruit. Grapefruit. That's right there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I like their cans. I like the way their cans look. Yeah, I do. I do like the way the cans look. Uh, I like the water thing. Uh, you know, if there were two seltzers sitting on the shelf and I didn't know what to get, that water thing would tell me on it. Yeah. Honestly. So, onto the grapefruit. Same thing. 4.5%. Whew. That's strong grapefruit. It's almost peppery. It's got very strong grapefruit in there. Whew. Kind of reminds me of some kind of grapefruit candy. Grapefruit candy, grapefruit soap or something. St. Ives or something. They're not St. Ives. The soap, what is it St. Ives? I don't know. Something like that. St. Ives is a beer too, so I don't. Pretty mild in flavor compared to the nose on it. Not bad though. It's too sweet. Too sweet for grapefruit. But that's just my opinion. You know. Very smooth, though. As far as seltzers no, go, no, these are smooth. definitely, so far, some of the smoothest seltzers. I think that's pretty good. I still that's think not bad. I still think it's better than Claw. I don't. I do. Um, six. I'll give it a six as well. I mean, it was good. Better than average. All right, I'm picking on this one. You picked the grapefruit. And then I, you said grapefruit? Grapefruit? Grapefruit. Yeah, that's how it went. So black black cherry. Six. Uh, again, these seltzers are much smoother than uh, your claws or Trulies. No funk on the back end, which is very important for a good seltzer. Which, truly, that's all you get is the funk. What's that other one? Bon Vive or something? That other bon seltzer? Boy. Yeah. Whew! Now that one's not as uh, jello y as a lot of seltzers, you know what I mean? It's kind of faint. <coughs> cherry. I mean, it's there. Good flavor. That's a good black cherry flavor. I'll give it that. Yeah. It's 
So like it better than claws. That's still for my claws. We're gonna have to keep four and uh, do a head to head with claws. That's fine. You know, it's not everybody can have their own personal preferences. I'm not saying it's bad. It's good, and it's cheaper than claws. Uh, better than a lot of the other seltzers out there. But I can find claws. You know, first time we. This found was real it. hard to find. Yeah. And I was there a week ago when they didn't have them. They only had two when we came in. There were two packs left. Um. Six point five on Black Cherry. It's gotta stick with a six on this one. Mm -hmm. Number of beast, huh? Hmm. All right, mango next. Hmm. Yeah, radar would hate doing this. I'm glad I got you in here. I love seltzers. And you know, these have been pretty easy to drink. For sure. But take you a couple home. Uh, the only problem I'm actually kind of having with them, though, is they're, they're pretty filling. Like, you see how much we've been doing? Yeah. You know, I can usually drink quite a bit of White Claw before I get that full of filling. Mm -hmm. Kind of getting that. But, Carbonation. You know, yeah. <clears throat> but anyway, let's go on with uh, mango here. On the nose? Uh, A sweet mango. Yeah, it smells good. Not too armpitty. Mango. It's good. 6.5. Give it a 6. Now, it's, look, I, I'm liking them. They're good. They're easy drinking. But they're just kind of missing, like, that seltzer bit to them. You're talking about the, the carbonation bite. I know what you're saying. Yeah, they're just... I don't like that. I like how these are slightly smoother. Uh, I like that bite. Yeah. I get what you're saying. These are smooth. I'm not a huge seltzer fan. Coming from somebody who's not a seltzer fan, if I had... To choose seltzers, uh, I would go ahead and say I might pick the... If, if it's not going to be a spritzer, which is vodka and juice, or vodka and seltzer, uh, I would pick something like this. If yeah. I would pick seltzer. It doesn't have any funk in it. No weird papery flavors. No weird underlining flavor. It is 90 calories, slightly less calories. Not much. It's That's not really, you know, what, 5, 10 calories in that yeah. big of a deal. Um, hard to find, which is a problem. Uh, overall, I'm going to rate the pack as a whole. Uh, I'm going to go with a 7 overall as the pack for seltzers. Uh, I know that's higher than I've rated some of the other seltzers, but as a whole, I think the pack is strong for a seltzer pack. No, no, it's a strong pack. The yeah. price is good. You know, I'm, I'll give it an 8 for the pack. Now, I know you'd be like, okay, there's still, you've been giving them 6, 6, 6, 6, 6. Yes, but the pack as a whole is a good fun the extra. Pack. The mango has... Five more milligrams of sodium than the rest of them. That matters to you. Yeah, kind of. Uh, well, now that I know that, so, no, I'm still going to keep it at an eight. We don't know what claws are. I don't know what claws sodium but, is. But, you know, it's a good deal. Smooth. Smooth. The cost, the cost, you know. I go and buy a 12 pack of white claw. I did it Tuesday, probably. You did it Saturday. Well, I bought more. Oh. And I actually bought those Friday. Um, but yeah, stopped at the gas station. It was like eighteen oh one. Mm -hmm. You know, calls are a little up there. Sixteen ninety nine for twelve pack. Yeah, fifteen ninety nine if you came on sale. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, so you know, cheaper price. So. Um. Yeah. I mean, they're good for what they are. Absolutely recommend them if you're oh, yeah. if, you, if you're if you're a seltzer person. Uh, again, not a big seltzer fan. I'd rather just have a beer. That's just me. Still, he's a big seltzer guy. If he's saying they're good, you know they're they're where it's at for seltzers. No. Um, again, he's right. It doesn't have that that bite that you get from like some claws and some other seltzers. Even though all these brand has that that bite that no. you're looking for, it's like a I think it's a carbonation kind of thing. But again, nothing funky on it. So absolutely worth the uh, m worth the money. Fifteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen bucks. Yeah. And it's seltzers with a mission, you know. Yeah, it's, it's cool that they're restoring waterways or whatever. Me as a fisherman, uh, I think that's cool. I'm always looking for new places to fish. That matters to me. Uh, slim cans is what all seltzers come in nowadays. That's nothing new. 
Most sales between four and six percent. Some of them there's there's eights. When, yeah. they, when they get above six, they're gross. So yeah. they kind of you, you can't kind of want to stick with five. Yeah, you know, it's a good mark. Yeah, keep not four and five. I wouldn't go below that or higher than that. They just yeah they get funk. But yeah, recommend them. You too. Oh yeah. All right. Well, that's been our episode. If there's something you'd like to see on the channel, like leave a comment down. Hello. Don't forget to hit that like button. I'm Special K. I'm still reserved. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.